good here now, right? We're good. Huh. There's a there's a crate up there. Like a loot, like a loot, uh, crate. Does loot crates still exist? Do they still make loot crates? Um, f just for context, I'm not talking about uh loot boxes. That's a completely different thing. I'm talking about loot crates, which were like uh little like crates that you could get mailed to you that have all kinds of like bullshit knick and knack nerd crap. Awful. Uh, sponsored a lot of podcasts and videos and shit. I haven't heard a fucking whisper about them in years now. Uh, due to recent fluctuations in the nearest control point, this area's stability has been downgraded to yellow. Uh, green, stable, low, yellow, low possibility of unanticipated building shifts. Okay, so building shifts. Sounds great. Am I gonna let, like, oh god. I can't even imagine what it would be like if, uh... This game had a mechanic where the game just, uh, where the uh, where the game world just like constantly reconfigured itself. I would have problems. I have, wait. Uh, where am I trying to go? That's not a door. Oh, hello. There's a door there. I'm blind. Uh, is there anything over here? Nope. Alright. Hello? Oh. This room looks hospitable. Dead Letters. That's a fucking cool name for a place. Bang. Make me regret that. You got- Oh, yeah, you're- you're trying. Putting forth an effort. Hey. Uh, did you not? I'd appreciate it if you would just, uh, like, hey, 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 bud. It would be super cool if you could, like, not. Oh, I can. I totally forgot that em environments are very, very destructible. Oh, uh, that was another, that was another folk. Hello, folk. Wow, you have uh, a lot of armor, huh? You're totally gonna be a problem for me. Especially considering we need to fucking recharge our gun. Hey. Are all of you dead now? Oh, no. Ow. Oh, shit. Who shot me? Is it you? Hey. 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 Lock it the fuck off. Do not appreciate your sass, young man. A hey, let's uh, do that. Does this heal me? It'd be super cool if this like healed me. I don't know if it does, but it would be super, super, duper cool. Hey, full health, right? Full health. Full health. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Okay. Uh. So there's a lot to see here, I think. Oh, machine god. I had a dream and I built the thing I saw in my dream. A machine that will contain god, but not the god you know or the ones anyone knows. A new god. This machine will be his body, his heart, and his mind. I made it just like the dream showed me. I used the motor from the refrigerator and the coils from my toaster and the fans, plus the timing belt from my car's engine and the wheels from my son's skateboard. God can't move yet, but the dream said he would learn how on his own. This is just a beginner's body. Like a baby's, but a machine instead. God only needs a place to start. If you want to interview me, please contact me at the address on the envelope. My phone does not work anymore. I had to use the dialing plate on God. Uh, neat. He found God. Or built God? Built God. He didn't find God. Kind of made it. And it's a... God's a robot. I love the idea of a robot God. Ooh, hello. You look... Suspicious. Singing fish! Mr. Governor, I called the police, uh, but they never came to my house. I got a problem, and you got to send folk to fix it. I got my wife one of them singing fish on the walls. It's not a real fish. It sings when you hit a button. 
but it's got the devil in it. It flies around at night and sings devil songs. There's a lot of cuss words. The devil got in my house because of the fish and you got to come handle it. My wife is real upset. When can you come? Sincerely, Dwayne Barr. Mm. Oh, okay. Computer. Don't break. That sucks. Uh... Why was there just like a blank sticky note on an empty uh, uh, whiteboard? Is that what they're called? I was going to say like pen board. It's like a chalkboard, but use a pen on it. Hey, what's that? Greetings, Director Trench. I'd like to thank you for approving my request for the Dead Letters Archive. Cataloging the Bureau's collection of delinquent mail will provide an extremely handy database that research teams can use to search for any connections or related topics found among the letters. Aside from the more convent aside from the more functional purposes, the archive will allow us to preserve these windows into authentic human encounters with the paranatural world. The letters came to us from various places and times, gathered by the Postal Service as undeliverable. The Bureau is the perfect home for them. I realize not all letters contain accounts of genuine paranatural events. But even the erroneous ones allow us insight into how the unknown is perceived by real people. Of course, I will first compile a system to allow us to analyze the letters for any information or suspected connections to AWEs and other altered materials. So thank you again. Can't wait to delve into my dead letters. Uh, er, sounds great. Uh, nothing. There is something very valuable for us uh, content-wise. I just got to find it. I think it might be in here. It is definitely in here. Uh, Hello, avid readers. The Bureau Book Bunch will convene at the usual spot in the corner table of the cafeteria at 5 p.m. on Tuesday. Currently discussing Unless You by J.D. Brooks. Everyone should get their reviews to be by Monday before lunch so I can generate some conversational starters before the meeting. Happy reading, Penny Bartwell. Ah, uh, that sounds like boring bullshit. Hello. Here's the important thing. It's very Candle Cove. That shit sucks. Hey, dirty rotten fart person. <laughs> Ah, uh, that also sucks. I don't know what missing in actions is, but I sure wish someone would find her. Uh, yeah. We'll find your mama together. Uh So like that was weird, right? Are we all in agreement that was uh, that was strange? I have to wonder if like the characters in that show are uh, self-aware. So I mean, judging from what we've seen so far, that w that seems like it would be pretty much uh, on par. Uh, to whom it may concern, I am being contacted by the past presidents of the United States of America. They appear as spirit guides, giving me their wisdom. John Adams keeps saying I need to fix America, but I can't really understand him. They all have a lot of opinions. Please tell me I'm imagining it. Uh, uh, people tell me I'm imagining it, but Theodore Roosevelt showed me how to fix my lawnmower, and I don't know a thing about lawnmowers. Explain that. I have great dead men telling me about the past and the present. If you'd like to use my abilities to help run the government, please let me know. I know the White House could use me. Yours in earnest, James Bartholomew. Ah, he seems like a nice dude. Very friendly, cordial, polite. Uh, okay, I think we... There's an upstairs. 
There is more upstairs shenanigans. Th a lot of this LP is going to be me reading at you. Uh, which I, I guess is kind of what we do here. Hi. Just look at it. Uh-huh. Wow. Incredible. I recorded 80 kilobytes within the last, like, half a second. Really, I really hate the angle that we're to made to watch this. And I think you can watch these back later at the at the proper, you know, perspective. Oops. Sick. Cool. That's lame. Huh. Y'all are really impressive for launching stuff that I I could just throw across the room. Uh, is there anything else? There's there's the control point. We we did that. And okay, we're done. Let's go. Let's move on. Oh hey, there's blood and a lot of people floating about, which doesn't seem uh exactly great. Maybe, like... Oh. Well, that sucks. Uh... Sir? Are you dead? Yeah. Yeah, it seems like it. Object of power. It's like oh! Holy fuck. Okay. Alright. Okay, so it seems to launch, uh, three. Ow. Stop. That hurts. Oh. Oh, hey, cool. This room's a dead end. Love that. Got an item. Uh, and, oh, is that, is that it? Really? Is that? Oh, fuck. Okay, let's run. Go. Oh. Hello. Goodbye. Okay, as long as there's like no enemies, we'll probably be okay. Right? Oh! Great! That sucks shit! Uh, you're mine. Now I have your power! Or, we gotta, oh, we gotta do like a tutorial, like a tutorial, uh, uh, danger room thing first with the board. Or do we? Yeah. I mean, yeah, they're, they're, the, the board? I, I mean, I, I imagine uh, the board would kind of assume that they're the ones that are, like, actually in charge. Line cube slash thingamajig into the hole. To advance slash score. Do we get points for that? We're we playing some, like, playing some... Oh, oh, hoops. Is there, like, a, is there like stamina? I can't remember if there's stamina. Hi! Fuck you! Y'all ain't shit! Y'all ain't, ain't even... Ain't even stepped to me. I don't even... I don't know what the... Fuck I'm saying... Anymore. Uh... Can I, like... You, I know you want me to use the launch and all. Am I still allowed to use the gun? Seems like it. That wasn't counted as cheating, even though it totally was. Cool. Are we, can we? The hiss slash antagonist is seeking a astral plane. 
Cool. You were gone. Cut off. Yeah, that alternate parallel dimension seems like Still some hot right? this will help fucking bullshit. This. Oh, hi guys. How's it going? Good. Glad everyone's having a good time. Um, oh, I need to kill you, like, immediately. Hey, yeah, no. You don't get to, like, be alive, actually. Uh, hey. Piss off. Uh-oh. Oh, oh you wait, what? How are you still alive? Fuck off. Is it everybody? That... That seems like it's everybody. Also, that seemed uh, a touch too high, so... I guess we'll take the long way. Also, I wanted to see if there's any like additional notes as well. Nope. Alright. We're good. Can I, how do I, like, not have, like, the most clearance in the universe right now? Uh, uh, like, I think right by the door would be a good place to hide secret shit. Are you... Really? Oh, is it, No, no, we went in there! Oh. Hi. No. You don't... You don't get to be alive. That's a privilege. You don't have I need to work on my friggin catchphrases hello oh I got a box uh great oh hey what's that uh, Book Club Notes for Penny by L. Sampson uh, so I don't usually read a lot of sci-fi but as far as space operas go this was alright a title, unless you, could refer to a bunch of things in the book, I guess, but I thought it was a little vague and stupid. The way the characters kept throwing it around, almost like a catchphrase, got real annoying real fast. The best part of the story was the space battles. I sided with the fixers, obviously, because they had the coolest tech and their motives made the most sense to me. Honestly, if I had to choose between some hoity-toity flowers and gun space hippies, or a badass bunch of warriors who go around devouring planets like a cheap sushi on a Sunday, I know who I'm picking. That scene where they invade City Planet and convert the entire population using those brainworms, and that space dogfight between those two ace pilots signed me the fuck up. What kind of ruined the whole thing for me was when my favorite character got killed not even halfway through the story, but getting a battery cylinder launched into his face by a gravitational anomaly. His death that didn't feel necessary at all. Ah, you subscribe to the uh, YouTube commentator theory of... Uh, media criticism. I understand. Alright. 